Hi Lori, hi Myron, this is Clay over at Legendary Dodge and this is a 2014 Dodge Ram 2500 Laramie. I know it's not the color you're looking for, you guys are looking for something specifically white, a 6.4 Hemi engine, but this is just a tutorial about the options. We actually located a vehicle that's perfect for you guys. So if the options work, the cabin works, then we can order that in for you. Here you got your projector headlights covered by a Lexon casing. It's the same material made out of hockey visors. For your chrome bumper, you have your tow hooks right here. It's a bright day out, so hopefully you guys can see all of this. Chrome bumper with your chrome inserts. This actually has a 6.7 Cummins. Uh, the one you're looking for is a 6.4 and I understand that. But all the 2500s have uh, two batteries and they're both insulated so it's just going to make it a lot easier for you to start in frigid, temper frigid temperatures. Uh, all of the vehicles have fire safety blankets and noise cancelling out blankets. In the unlikely case of a fire, these little plastic inserts here will melt off. The blanket will fall down and smother the fire. You have a light there on the hood to illuminate the engine if it's dark out and you have to do some work on it. This vehicle also has crimple points. So if you are to rear end somebody in a collision, it's gonna take a lot of the impact. The engine's also designed to fall down and not into the cabin if you get it if you rear end someone. Hydraulics on the hoods, so it's really easy for you to close and open. 20 inch chrome rims. Those are the badges on the vehicle. That Cummins would be a 6.4 Hemi. Here you have your breakaway mirrors. They're heated and also if you guys are towing, I know this unit, it, uh, keyless entry didn't work, but it's working now. We just had to put a new battery in the key fob. So now it opens and closes no problem. Here's the interior, the wood grain on the side door, all the controls for the power windows and power locks, the baseball stitching. You have all the power controls on the seat with the memories, your headlights, I mean your uh, controls for the lights, you got your automatics, I always keep mine on automatic, power pedal, that's the steering wheel, all the controls for voice recognition or Bluetooth uh, to be able to change radio stations and everything on the, the steering wheel. There's the cluster. So you're gonna be able to get your messages there. So what Chrysler will actually do now is they'll just email you a message if there's a recall on the vehicle. Then it'll show your oil changes, uh, all of that fun stuff. There's your audio control, your trailer control, uh, your trips B and trip A, your fuel economy, and all your vehicle info so it's going to have your engine hours your gauge summary so all the coolant and transmission and oil temperatures your exhaust well that's in a Cummins this the 6.4 won't have that your battery voltage your fuel filter life oil life transmission temperature and your tire pressure And then your speedometer, You'll, you can change it from kilometers an hour to miles per hour. If you guys are making trips to the States, it makes it a lot easier. All right, then you have your 8.4 Uconnect uh, touchscreen. It's very user friendly. You have your navigation in there, Bluetooth controls. You actually have all the controls for the climate as well. 
your trailer brake, heated and cooled seats, uh, heated steering wheel, and you can turn your park assist off. This vehicle has a sunroof, uh, auto dimming mirrors. All the controls for the windows, the sunroof and the window are up there. So this back window actually opens and closes as well. You have your traditional outlet right here. You also have SD card, two USBs, and an auxiliary outlet right there. lot of storage space right in the middle of these bucket seats and what's really cool is they opened up this little center console so you have a lot extra storage space grab some cup holders you have dual coolers one on this side one on that side put some ice in there and some cold drinks or some sandwiches it'll keep it nice and fresh there these are actually these actually come out too so you can clean them fairly easily the seats come up got some more storage space there this little bench folds out so if you guys have a dog or if you're moving a TV or something like that uh, you won't do any damage to the leather seats What's really cool about this truck too is the doors do open at a 90 degree angle. You have your heated seats in the back and an auxiliary cord. I know Lori was saying that she wanted DVD but we could put them in the headrest no problem. This particular unit does not have running boards but the unit that I found you guys it has running boards. We could do the wheel the wheel ones for you guys if you want. Uh, the gas cap, all new Dodges have a siphon ball, so if someone's trying to steal your gasoline, the ball's going to go right up into the, the siphon and prevent them from stealing it. You have your LED tail lights, so it's just going to be an instant reaction time, no delay, and it's going to illuminate really bright, and very if it's very poor visibility, the guy behind you will be able to see it very easy. There's the Laramie badge, the Dodge Ram badge. There's your backup camera. Another really cool thing about this unit is if you lock it up, the tailgate locks too. You have your park assist cameras or uh, sensors, your class four receiver hitch, your four and your seven prong wiring harness. Some more badges. Under here you have an Alpine 8 inch subwoofer and amplifier so you're going to get some really good sound quality there. There's the other cooler right there. Get on the back door there's the baseball stitching that little trim of wood grain and then the ram badge power seats on the other side all right guys i hope you enjoyed the video uh take care and i'll talk to you soon i'm gonna send you some pictures as well